Good morning. It is 7.20. I'm in my music room and it's a disaster area. Today is gig day and I mean I've been working on this room for days. Um, as you can see it, you might be able to see it, but it's pretty messy. Video is coming up on how I reorganized my entire workroom. This is taking forever. <laughs> it's really crazy. I'm sorting every piece that's in this room. So today is gig day. It rained all night and luckily I already loaded up my car last night because I was afraid it was going to continue raining this morning. Weather forecast said there was going to be rain. It rained all night. It didn't really cool down. It is so warm and humid. It feels like South Texas where I lived for several years, and, but it's Germany. So yeah, I'm getting ready for my gig. Romy's still sleeping. I have to head out quite early. Nine o'clock, I wanna leave the house. At 11, the um, wedding starts, which is kinda nice because I will be done early. And yes, oh yes, I definitely have to make another trip to Ikea. It's totally on the way. And since I'm reorganizing this room here, I am in need of a few more things. So well, I'll get started into the day. is going to a friend's house and our car is currently not in our driveway because we have <laughs> construction going on. I'll make a video about this separately. Our driveway is just being redone and there's a pipe running there now because of the gutter. It needs to be underground. It used to be on the house, which damaged the house. Okay, so we parked our car way over here. Das ist ja nur ein ganz kleines Stück über die Ecke. Schneid ich an. Okay, I'm in the car. I'm on the Autobahn. Let me tell you some fun facts about the Autobahn. I know the Autobahn is famous in the whole entire world because everybody thinks you could just fly down, which is not entirely true. The truth is that there are portions of the Autobahn where there's not a speed limit. However, that's not a lot. <laughs> there are so many portions nowadays and it, it happens more and more to where there's 100K, 120K, 130K, and so driving fast, you can sometimes over like a few kilometers, but not really for a really long time. So where I'm driving right now, for example, it's 100 because there's a tunnel and so you have to slow down. There's the tunnel right here. I'm all in the dark. So another fun fact is that the Autobahn doesn't really ever go straight. If you really pay attention, it's never really straight. They do this on purpose. They never build it to where there's actually longer stretches that who glow, no, that, that go straight because when you drive fast, when you drive for a longer time, it it gives you this tunnel vision, which isn't good. It tricks out your brain. So that's why they always put slight curviness into the way they build Autobahn. Another thing is there are frequent announcements on the radio that there is a ghost driver, which means there's someone who drove onto the Autobahn the wrong way, which could be horrible. <clears throat> yes, my GPS. Which brings me to that next point. When you drive in Germany on the Autobahn, most people, I would say 95% of people, actually abide by the rules which state that you only drive on the left lane 
whenever you're passing someone on the right lane and that you have to you have to drive significantly fast enough to where you can actually pass that person that is on the right lane so that you're passing <laughs> if it's taking too long you might block the way which means you shouldn't be passing and that's actually a law and I think all of that makes for much safer driving. When I drove in Texas and in the States in general, it was just insane. Like people passing you on the left, people passing you on the right, a truck passing you on the left and a truck passing you on the right and you're sandwiched in the middle. To me, that's pretty scary. I actually think Autobahn driving is quite relaxed. Most of the time, unless there's a traffic jam and then it's horrible. I'm here at the church now. It's really pretty. This is in the old part of town. Nice church, but it is raining. like they're guarding the church, doesn't it? All right. Nobody here yet, but they will all come in shortly. And the song I'm actually gonna start with is A Moment Like This by Leona Lewis. I made myself a matcha latte, this time a hot one because it did rain, it's not that hot today. By the way, there's a video coming up with all the healthy lattes I make. I am here kind of early and I didn't really warm up. But here's the trick what I do when I didn't warm up ahead of time, when I haven't sung a lot. I will just sing along with the church songs, which of course I'm, if I had to sing for the entrance, I, that wouldn't work out, but I don't sing till later, so I just go ahead and sing the song, like there's the program, and I just sing along and I hum along, and then it, it's okay. That's fine. I'm just very blessed to have a voice that doesn't need tons of warming up. My voice always works because I also get out of my head. I assume that it's always going to work, so it usually does. I never actually got a nice gift like this. Um, this is where my money's in, I'm assuming. And it feels like a book, so I'm going to open it and see what's in there. Yummy, it's actually chocolates. So Romy will be happy about that. She loves these. done with the wedding all the stuff is already in my car now I'm on my way to Ikea <laughs> yet again
went to Ikea. It was so crowded, it's unbelievable. When school is off on a Saturday, it's actually kind of crazy to go to Ikea. I thought I was just gonna walk through there and just cruise through. Well, you couldn't really cruise because there's so many people that you just constantly have to walk slowly and you just can't really get anywhere. Well, I got my stuff and now I get my well-deserved lunch because it's already 3.30 and I haven't eaten since like 8.30 this morning. So this is what I'm having right here. It's, uh, I love this. It's just toast with tomato and there's some French cheese. I forgot to put salt on, but I'm gonna put some salt on. I'm gonna enjoy that now. And after that, I have a bunch of work to do. And then I wanna continue organizing my workroom. All right, now it's time to continue cleaning up the mess, the mess. I've already cleaned up just a little bit of the shelf. And next week I have a gig where the person wants me to sing among a, among a lot of other things. I actually have two gigs, two days in a row I'm singing at that same place. Uh, it's a wine festival or something. He wants me to sing Nessun Dorma. And uh, so in the soprano version, it's actually for a tenor in the original, but uh, he wants me to sing it. So I'm figuring just put on the karaoke and just kind of, I don't know. I don't know the words yet, but just try it out. up for today I'm tired now because it's been quite a week and this disaster here I know I'm not gonna get it all done probably until oh uh, I don't know end of next week or so I really need to get it done because I want to make some new videos for my other channel for my main channel and I need this new setup that I want to do and so well I don't know we'll just see how that goes making dinner now and calling it a day. Thank you so much for watching. It is awesome that you are hanging out with me and just kind of have a day with me and follow me around a little bit. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing so you can catch all the future videos. I love making videos about anything family, minimalism, cleaning and organizing, and healthy lifestyle. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I hope to see you for one of my next videos. Have an awesome day. Bye for now. Another thing. Okay. Thank you. Another thing is that